What's going on people? It's Pre Raptor here. Welcome back to well, technically not a welcome back. I've always been here, <laughs> but I've been always streaming on Twitch rather than YouTube this day. So I've, I haven't been doing much of YouTube videos compared to like posting small videos here and there, maybe like shots or like some uh first to threes like fights or gameplay videos, stuff like that. But if you guys um wanna catch me live, I mostly stream every day and I put my stream schedule on my Discord, which is link in the description as well. So check that out. Um I mostly stream on Twitch which is also in the description. Uh, check that out if you guys want to, because that's where I mostly stream every day, Monday to Friday, um, 8.30 p.m. Uh, up to late, depending on the time. The schedule might also change, but I'll also let you guys know in the Discord beforehand if any schedule changes or anything of that sort. But yeah, I've been streaming on Twitch most lately, and that's where I mostly play Tekken or variety of games now, actually. So I've, I've not been only focusing on Tekken, but variety of games. But... Uh, on the topic of Tekken, today was the day where they finally announced the new season 4 um, final character for Tekken 7, the original character, Lydia, basically. And um, I've, I've seen I've seen the um, trailer, but I wanted to do it like a proper reaction video again. So, yeah, let's let's quickly jump into the reaction and see how she is. Uh, in terms of play style and how she looks and all that good stuff, alright? So, that being said, uh, let me quickly switch and let's check the video out. Okay. Excited for this. So I've seen I've seen most of the trailer because I've seen it live, but I'm gonna I'm just gonna watch it with you guys again. Okay. First of all, I'm just gonna say I'm just gonna say since CD Projekt Red was already retweeted this tweet a long time ago saying that welcome to Poland all that stuff because CD Projekt is based in Poland. I get that, but if you see the character design on Lydia, it's basically like somewhere similar to Siri from Witcher 3. Uh, the scar, the white hair, uh, every, the facial features, everything. But just it's just a playstyle. But the, I, I feel like they kind of based it off Siri in terms of uh, appearance. Not gonna lie, uh, I I really love I really love her design, really love her design. Not what not what I expected, but I do believe the part where they showed her with the suit and everything is gonna be some of her secondary costume maybe. I I believe this is a default costume which is gonna drop through the entire game. Yeah. Uh, and apparently her playstyle is karate based, just like Jin. So it's it's karate, but I don't know what kind of karate it is. It's it is karate, but I don't know what it is. With a black belt and everything, it's kind of obviously. This stage, the stage though, it's from Tekken Five, the poolside, and it's the remix of the Tekken Five theme song or poolside song, basically. Yeah, it's like she's going to she's going to different stances. She's going to different stances. I feel like there's execution based in that. It's not completely like broken like Leroy and stuff like that. Parry. That's the first parry, right? That's second parry. That's a uh, healthy. It looks like a healthy. Or two parries, I think. I actually counted four parries. Just frame move. Ooh, that freaking that's sick. Kazama Jin! Obviously because he also does karate, so Kazama style karate. Ooh. Yeah, she's go she has stances. She definitely has stances. Look at that. That's, that's like one stance. I think she transitioned between two stances or something. Oh yeah, she has two rage drives. That's the first rage drive. This is the second one. It's like it's like, it's like a norm this day. Like every, character, every new character is... Should be having like two rage plans or something. The rage on. As usual, it's long as hell. It's long as hell. I must win for the people of Poland. Yeah, dude, she looks she looks awesome. She looks amazing. I, I didn't expect her design to be that good looking. Um, let's see what we have here. Hold on. 
So, uh, Island Paradox, and I also think the beach side is also one of her... Yeah, they showed the... It's also one of the breakable stages, I think, in the game. Probably. Um, on, online play enhancement. I think they already did that, didn't they? Or maybe it's coming up early in spring again. I think they're revamping it. Who knows, but... That's all for Season 4, I guess. Wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold on, did they say March 23rd is released date? I didn't actually see that. DLC 18 and 19. Is this DLC 18 and 19? It's March 23rd, isn't it? I Oh, so it's coming out day after tomorrow? Really? Interesting. I hmm. Okay. Okay then. 23rd. Actually did not see that. Maybe 18 and 19 is the other one? Kunumitsu and the stage? Oh, it is DLC 18, so it's day after tomorrow, dude. Holy shit, so it's coming out really quickly. Oh, but Max, Max, please, no. Sorry. Why is Max there? Let's, 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 let's pause up to the... I want to talk about this real quick. So, in terms of a playstyle, um, she looks... If she's, like, really executive, uh, executive, execution-based, I will play her. If her moveset is really easy, I might not try her because I, I don't like how everything in Leroy was really easy in terms of parries and everything that he did. Even the, even though they give us some give him some moves in like season four maybe but still it's, it's still broken right but um, Lydia seems really good like from they they did her justice from they did the trailer justice from what they showed before till now they did it justice so yeah I'm I'm really glad that um, they did not make it, from from by the looks of it it doesn't look that easy to do some of the things that she did from the stances and stuff so I'm hoping it's as it seems right. But that being said, let me know what you guys think about uh, Lydia in the comments down below. If you guys are going to play her, if you guys are going to check her out. Or what are your thoughts in general about the character or the future of Tekken maybe. Um, but again, if you want to guys, if you want to check me live, if you want to uh, hang out live, basically just uh, click, click, click the link in the description. I'm out of breath today. I've been, I've been speaking for non-stop for 8 hours, I think. I've been streaming and then I've been immediately doing this video. Sorry about that. But... Um, yeah, if you guys want to check me out live, it's on twitch.tv slash pre on It's in the description as well. Make sure to click that link and come and hang out and I will see you guys there. But that being said, that's it for me. Thank you guys for hanging out and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.